Well, would you looky here? Somebody bought two of our staffs. Let's go pull this up real quick. Claim our lovely earnings. That's a good old 60 bill. Let's put this a little bit closer to the wicked mobs. God damn it. We end up getting ourselves another brimstone staff. So that's actually pretty interesting. I've thought about this one. I think we might keep it, you know, and maybe we'll upgrade it to was it the iniquity and then we could take that and probably make ourselves one of the tier 13s maybe we can make the bow maybe we can make the glaive i'm not really sure what i want to do yet but if we could sell it for like another like 30 bill that'll put us even closer again and unlocking the wickeds which uh they're like what 200 bill if mine serves me right yeah 200 bill so it'll put us like almost like halfway uh, yeah, hold on. Let me throw it up in the POS to see if there's any more up there. Brimstone staff. Yeah, there's nothing there. But brimstone-wise, I think it's still just the shields, right? Yeah, it looks to be 450 bill for clubs. What the fuck? Uh, I mean, yeah. Yeah, fuck it. We'll, we'll, we'll throw it up there for a cheeky price. We'll say... We'll say 300 bill. I throw it up there for now. I don't expect it to sell considering the last one sold for 30. But, uh, I mean, you never know, right? So, it looks like I fucked up. That brimstone staff we just put in the POS is now sold. We just made 300 bill off that shit. And we sold the first two for 30. Uh, yeah. I kind of feel bad about that one, to be honest. Because we missed out on a lot of money. We could have netted ourselves quite a decent chunk, but now we have 374 bill, which we can now unlock the wicked mobs. I think I still want to stay here, though, for us getting the brimstone pet. Oh, I can't really see the drop rate and everything off that while we're killing a metric fuck ton of them. But yeah, we can get the pet. Uh, I think we're... What are we looking at? And we're looking at 10k, so we still have another like 60k left to go, and then we can start doing the wicked. Oh, the wicked's only 50,000, huh? Yeah, fuck it. We might just swap the Wicked, to be honest. Because it's 50,000 kills. Obviously, I assume it's HP is a lot fucking more than these Brimstones, but hopefully it's not, like, too, too bad, right? Let me just, uh... Yeah, let's, let's unlock it real quick. We'll have a look. Bum, 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 bum. Good old Wicked. Yes, I would like to pay. What the fuck? I seriously need to have it in my inventory. 375k, there we go. Let's try this again. Wicked Reavers. Gimme, gimme. And that's it. Let's see. We'll do open instance real quick. Oh, my level. Ah, oh, there we go. Wicked Reavers. Gimme, gimme. And let's check the damage on these. Okay, so they got 50 bill, which isn't terrible. We're killing them at a fast rate with Vampy's gear. Yeah, I think we'll just skip over the Levi or the Brimstone boss and we'll just go for Wicked. Drop rates for these dudes are what? Oh, they actually don't have a dry streak. Okay. That might be something to think about. Because I think Brimstones do have a dry streak. And if the Brimstone gear is selling that quick, I don't know if Wicked's going to be selling quick at all. Considering we did see a lot of it there in the POS. Oh, I guess that's the dude who bought my, uh, my Brimstone staffs. If I was to take a wild gamble. Yep. Fuck. Yeah, I guess we'll just stick here for now. Well, we're back here for another global. Maybe we'll get spooned for another key. Or sorry, not another key. We might get another box. Not really holding my breath on it, though. But honestly, this global is so good to fucking do. And look at all the people coming here to kill it. Holy shit. But yeah, two and a half build HP. Obviously, damage being capped. We'll see uh, when it's dead. Damn. And unfortunately, we got fucked. Oh, so far, I think we're not doing too, too bad. We're up to 150 Sinister Keys now. We're at the kill on a fuck ton of these. Unfortunately, they don't have a dry streak. So that part is kind of unfortunate. But pet-wise, I think we're doing pretty good. I think we're like a fifth of the way there. Where is it? Pet Wicked. Yeah, we're at 8,700. We're almost at a fifth of the way there. So it's going to give us 700% drop rate, 500 double drop rate, and then 420 range damage boost. Which is going to be fucking sick. And then that'll probably be our pet until probably Sinister. Because then that'll be a Tribrid pet which is sick. And then the Witchling one after that. Once we do unlock it. It's going to be pretty huge as well. But 
all in all, we're doing pretty good. Vampy's back now, so we do have to give over the gear. We did do a couple of globals here as well, as you can tell from like the one dollar bonds, what not to. Got ourselves a box to bewitched. Maybe we get spooned. Uh nope, doesn't look like it. That's really fucking unfortunate out of all the things we could have got. Oh well, what can you do? Well, here we are. We gotta give Vampy back his stuff, because the dude is back to do some grinding. Appreciate it as always, him loading us the gear. But we do have quite a few keys open up though, hey, we got 224 Sinister, we got a couple of Brimstones, we got a bunch of boss tokens too, so we'll probably check out to see how much we can convert those for minigame tickets so we can actually get our own accessories. But uh, let's go down the chests. Alright, first things first, we'll rip open the Brimstones. See if it's anything worth noting. Oh wow, we got Brimstone Boots. That's pretty interesting. Okay. I think that uh, is it an upgrade. I believe those boots are an upgrade for us, but let's rip open these sinister keys. This is what we're here for. I think I just spent all my energy on those boots. Got a couple of achievements we can claim as well. Once I find the achievement tab. Bit of cash for killing the reavers and whatnot. Alright, and we get nothing. Let's check out the, uh, the boss token shop. And those brimstone boots were indeed fact and upgrades. We had Eternals prior, so that's pretty good. We can resolve those for 15 mil. It's basically nothing now. It's garbage. But boss point shop, we're looking at 50 per mini game ticket. Hmm, let me do the math. So we can buy ourselves 280k mini game tokens. And then once I find the mini game shop. Ah, uh, here we go. What can I get for 300k? Oh, I can actually get the eternal or ethereal amulet. I get the gilded ring. Hmm. Not close to getting the wings, but it's not a bad start. This actually might not be too, too bad. So we could probably pick up, say, like the amulet for an example. And then we could probably just get the godly arrows, right? You know what I'm saying? Hmm. And there you have it. That's our 280k minigame tickets. I don't think we have very much more in the bank. Uh, I don't see any. Oh, we got, well, 300. Crazy. All right. But no, that's all good. So we'll come up to the minigame shop. We will probably grab the amulet if I was to guess. We could even... Uh, I know we'll definitely be getting the godly arrows when we get 50k. But uh, yeah, we'll go first with the amulet. Which is very good. And then we just need another 18k for the arrow. Damn, and that amulet straight up like 4 mil damage boost, which is always very nice. Not too bad with our gear. We just need to get rid of these eternal gloves, get rid of the leviathan. I wonder how much Wicked's going for right now. Might be able to pick up a piece or two.